today I'm here with my second December TBR. If you guys are new to my channel, then you don't know that my mom actually picks my TBR every month, and this month she decided that she wanted to have two different themes because there's always some theme that goes along with each TBR and how she picked the books. So for the first half of the month, she chose fairy tale retellings, and then for the second half of the month, she chose royalty. So without further ado, here are the six books she chose for me to read in the month of December part two. <laughs> Let us get started. <sighs> the first book that she chose was The Queen Rising by Rebecca Ross. This book follows a 17 year old named Brianna who lives in a kingdom where you have to choose your passion which is basically your talent. So she takes a very long time to decide her passion is going to be knowledge and with her passion is supposed to come a patron which I'm assuming is basically like a husband, but she never gets chosen until a discarded prince from a faraway kingdom comes and decides that he is going to be her patron. But she quickly realizes that he has ulterior motives for choosing her. A war is started and Brianna has to decide which side she wants to fight for. Seems fun, royalty, so it fits the theme. So that is book number one I'm supposed to read. The second book that she chose is Everless and this is by Sarah Holland. The book follows a land called Sempera, which is ruled by the aristocrats, and one of the families, the girlings, are part of this elite. It follows a girl named Jules Ember who lived on the girling's estate as one of their servants. A terrible accident ends up causing her family to need to leave Everless. She gets called back to help with a wedding that is about to happen, and then she learns the secrets of Everless, and things happen. But I've heard mixed things about this, so I'm kind of intrigued to see what I think of it but we'll see if I get to it. The next book is Red Queen by Victoria Aveyard, and I don't really think I need to give a synopsis of this since it is such a popular book. I've also heard a lot of mixed things about this one, so I'm kind of interested to finally pick it up and see what I think as well. The next book I'm definitely very excited about because everybody seems to give it a 5 out of 5 stars, and it is The Cruel Prince by Holly Black. The most I know about this is that it has a prince and fairies, and some girl named Jude is kidnapped by the fairies, so... I'm intrigued. The next book I have is Ash Princess and this is by Laura Sebastian and I honestly have not heard that much about this. All I know is that there's a girl who is imprisoned as a slave and then she's called the Ash Princess which is basically like an insult as a prisoner and then she like starts a rebellion against the king or something like that. Honestly I'm probably very wrong. I like the cover so I'm hoping I like the story just so I can keep the book and have a pretty cover on my shelf. And then the final book that she chose, I'm bitter about right now because I'm about 60% in and I'm really not liking it. But it is Enchantment by Orson Scott Card and this is like a modern twist on Sleeping Beauty, but I'm just not enjoying it. It's very like Christianity, like it's the best thing ever and Judaism is bad and I'm just like, eh. I'm not religious in any way for any religion. And it, I'm just finding it boring, to be honest. We're gonna push through though because I have the inability to DNF books, so you'll probably end up seeing it in a unhaul video coming soon, so I guess stay tuned for that. All right guys, so those were the next six books that my mom thinks that I should read for the month of December, so hopefully we get through of them all before the month is over. Let me know down below if you guys have read any of these and what you thought of them, and I will see you all in my next video. Goodbye!